Hello, I'm back. It's 7 10 p.m. I got dry skin all over. But anyway, I think I have a piece of dandruff in my eyelash, you know, in my eye. But um, anyway, um, so I'm gonna post the link in the description box to a blog post of me basically. I copied and pasted onto my blog what my GoFundMe explanation was. And I don't know if y'all can do me a favor and tell me in the comment section of this video on uh, what I could have done or said that that was that serious, seriously wrong or bad, excuse me, or evil to um that the fact that they're saying that I violated the terms of service and that I'm banned from ever um excuse me I'm sorry for doing that um that I'm banned for forever from um I'm banned forever from from um ever posting on GoFundMe again so tell me what did I say that was um prohibited conduct I, I mean and, and I feel like today is just one of those days where I just feel like I want to give up and I've been like attacked all day and so today I'm questioning is it a sat satanic ritual high day because I just had a rough I just had it really rough today really bad so y'all can look at the video before this one also so i mean if, if i'm supposed to be god's chosen or a, one of the chosen ones everything i do or say is just bad wrong or inappropriate behavior or that behavior won't be tolerated i mean it's the narcissistic abusers they can always have their tantrums whenever they feel like it so you know but then they're the ones always lecturing me about bad behavior. Again, how am I supposed to survive? And I'm not trying to be, I mean, I already explained. So in the description box, I, I don't know if I have enough characters in, in, um, to put the, my blog post in the title. But um, I mean, I mean, or, or is that just go, un, go fund me? Do they have another way that, that they censor people as well? If they censor truth tellers in a way that truth tellers don't deserve the right to survive or live or exist. And so, you, you know, as I said, the perps are kicking back laughing. And then shortly after I posted the, the previous video, I might have to get back out my computer because I think there was one perp or three different perps that left three messages from like an unknown number, but I haven't yet listened to them. Un unknown, um, and so they're probably, gonna, but they think they got the upper hand, but they're the ones going to hell. So, um, you know, if I can't fit it in the title. I'm going to put it in the description box, um, the link to the blog post that I wrote that, um, the blog post that, you know, explains my intent for that GoFundMe. And I'm thinking, well, maybe I should have left the previous GoFundMe. Maybe I should have just left it up. But the perp's probably going to laugh and say, ah, ha, ha, we're going to show you. We're going to show you that you can't have the GoFundMe up. So th they probably think that they're going to get revenge and try to teach me a lesson for exposing the hell out of them. You know, exposing the eugenics and everything, everything like that. So, you know, truth tellers are blocked from the right to survive. But hey... I got, I mean, I got my blog up, you know, I said the exact same thing, so, 
I'm just I'm just really um that it wasn't my doing. And so um you know they'll the perps will lie and say that well Candy was the one who got her own GoFundMe taken down. Why would I put the GoFundMe up just for the intent of taking it down? That's like when y'all try to falsely say that well Candy got a job but why she's gonna quit. Or, or I'm like, why would I get a job just to quit? No, if I got wrongfully fired. Or workplace mobbed off the job. So, you know, the perps got my, um, my GoFundMe taken down within like 24 or 25 hours. And then the, um, the previous video, I meant to say that the perps are going to make it like I'm the laughing stock of the year 2022, 2022. And there I accidentally made a mistake of saying 2021. So, you know, it feels like as if I'm talking to a brick wall. You know, I mean, I have ebooks, I have, um, you know, my short stories and everything, trying to make a living. And they just block everything, and then they want to talk about me being greedy and begging all the time. But it's not that I'm obsessed. I'm just trying to survive. But they are the ones obsessed with what I eat or what I do with my money. And they're obsessed with everything about me. But they want to try to make like I'm this hell-bound, covetous, greedy person who's just all about money and food. But I'm denied the right to have any of these basic things to survive day to day just because they want me to sell out in order to get those things. And then I'll have that right to have all those things, plus a car and plus vacations and everything else, lavish, luxury, unnecessary vacations and everything else. So, well, if nothing happens later on tonight, then I'll see y'all tomorrow.